Hello everyone, good evening and welcome back to Canal Tricks. I'm Kishore here again with uh, top 6 breakout stocks. Let me start with Nifty and Bank Nifty analysis and we'll share the top 6 breakout stocks. This is Nifty daily time frame chart. Yesterday I was mentioned the buying trend is going to happen and if the sellers are more aggressive around the level of 16,700 to 750 then we can expect the downfall till around the yesterday's closing price and if the buyers are taking charge then the price will go up to the resistance level but the buyers are very weak that is the main reason price fall was happened till yesterday's low and also closed to the same level of yesterday's low so it is indicating about the bearishness is uh, very stronger and tomorrow also we can expect the same downfall is going to happen with gap up open because today end of the session having some of the buying pressure might be it's a short covering of today price and uh, some of the rollover was happened so based on that i'm expecting the gap up around 16550 or 16600 levels and uh, after that uh, the fall only going to happen if the buyers are uh, supporting around the level of uh, today's low below level then we can expect the neutral candle by tomorrow uh, again it will come back to the today's opening price and close on the same level possible based on the buyer strength otherwise the downfall is going to happen till the range of this support area next one is bank nifty before of that i will share the support and resistance the support one is 16450 support two 16360 resistance one 16590 resistance two 16680 for nifty tomorrow and next is bank nifty bank nifty uh, based on yesterday i was mentioned this is a, a rejection area so if having more number of selling then we can expect the downfall and uh, as i said in nifty the same only uh, expected in the same bank nifty which means uh, 35300 or 400 levels uh, is a downfall may happen from the level of this 35800 but there is no buying stuff again in this bank nifty that is a main reason fall was a continue till the yesterday's low and closed the same level of yesterday's low now uh, based on this uh, last two candles it is showing about this support is not having more strength so we can expect the further downfall in the upcoming period to break 34,000 uh, in next week I'm expecting possibilities are more uh, to break this level okay anyway now i'm expecting based on today candle tomorrow will be a neutral session or bearish only uh, because of uh, this end of the session having some buying stuff uh, tomorrow i am expecting a gap up open around 35200 levels with the more selling pressure and if the sellers are more as i uh, expected then we can expect the downfall to cross below 34500 also and if in case the buyers are supporting below this today's low then we can expect the pullback to uh, close near to the day's opening price like a neutral we can expect by tomorrow whatever uh, overall the trend is in week only selling mode only so that is uh, favorable for downfall for tomorrow okay let's see what will happen and uh, overall uh, my expectation is bearish candle only by tomorrow so these are the support and resistance for tomorrow resistance one is 35150 resistance two 35320 support one 34800 support two 34650 let's see what will happen and now let me share the top six breakout stocks one by one first one is adani ports it's look like a triangle like formation it's a chart pattern actually and uh, overall it's in a sideways range and every top of the level having selling pressure so i'm expecting the downfall only by tomorrow and looking for the selling opportunity below 706 with the stop loss of 708 and 702 is my expected target then 696 is the next level target next one is bajaj finance bajaj finance also is in a sideways range previous existing sideways range uh, and also trend line broken so now I'm expecting the same downfall is going to happen by tomorrow. Selling, I'm looking at 6735 breaking point and stop loss is 6745. 
and target expecting 6705 then 6670 and if the sellers are more aggressive around the level of 6670 then the possibilities are more to reach 6600 next one is bardi atal so bardi atal uh, is look like a triangle again with the uh, range so i'm expecting uh, upward momentum breakout based on the buyer stuff here i happen a lot so buying looking about 673 with the stop loss of 672 target expecting 676 and 683 is the next level target next one is bpcl so bpcl also in sideways previously also and now trend line breakout confirmed so i'm looking for a small upward momentum breakout and buying opportunity about 348 i'm focusing with the stop loss of 346 target 350 then 354 expecting let's see next one is sipla sipla is in high price and also trend line broken sideways momentum uh, overall in resistance area so i'm expecting the selling opportunity by tomorrow below 933 with the stop loss of 935 and target 930 then 925 is my second level target so the price action workshop started again and the dates also declared in my telegram and twitter so if anyone is interested you can uh, join by enrolling and also text in whatsapp for uh, further complete course syllabus details last stock is sbin so sbin is in sideways range with a good buying build up at the point of support area previously so i'm focusing for a buying opportunity above 470 actually but uh, i'm looking the buying opportunity around 468 with uh, a small risk factor okay uh, so 468 means uh, 466 we can fix the stop loss and the target i'm expecting 474 and 477 is the next level target but actually entry point is 470 okay uh, risk taking people can uh, enter at uh, 468 level with the stop loss of 466 and the target i'm expecting this only uh, safety target is a 470 for 468 entry okay these are the stocks i filtered and uh, shared with you all thanks for uh, watching this video like share and comment we'll see you in next video update thank you bye bye take care